you're afraid. Of course I am afraid. But you'll be safe now, held in the arms of your god. Have my brothers taught you nothing? I know what waits for me. For all of us. If not your god, then what? Nothing. Nothing waits. And that is what I fear. You don't believe. How could I, given what I know? What I've seen? Our treasure was the proof. Proof of what? That this life is all we have. Linger a while longer, then, and tell me of the part you were to play. A blockade by sea. To keep the fool kings and queens from sending reinforcements. Once we... Once we... Conquered the Holy Land? Freed it, you fool. From the tyranny of faith. Freedom? You worked to overthrow cities, control men's minds, murdered any who spoke against you. I followed my orders, believing in my cause. Same as you. Tair, you've caused quite a stir. I've done as requested. Sabran's life is ended. So it is. So it is. You should ride for Masiaf and inform Al Muallim of your success. Yes. I should return and speak to him. Of this and other things. Is everything all right, my friend? You seem distant. It's nothing, Rafiq. Just a lot on my mind. Talk to me then. Let me help. I need to make sense of this myself first. Thank you for the offer. It is the men you kill, isn't it? You feel something for them. How? Ah, my friend. 
You are not meant to enjoy these grim tasks. Regret, uncertainty, sympathy. This is to be expected. I should not fear these feelings. You should embrace them. They are what keep you human. What if I'm wrong? What if these men are not meant to die? What if they mean well? Misguided, perhaps, but pure in motive. I am but a Rafiq, Altair, and such things are beyond me. Perhaps Al-Mu'alim can help you to make sense of it. Yes. Perhaps. Thank you, Rafiq. It is my pleasure to have served with one as skilled as you. When you're out of knives, refill your stock by returning to Messiah or by pickpocketing thugs. Welcome home, child. What news? Another of the named is put to rest. Then it would appear your work is nearly complete, and your status restored. A question, Master, if I may. Ask, and I will answer. Why these men, Jubayer and Sabrand? Ah, don't you see? They paved the way for change. Ensure threats both old and new are not given cause to intervene. To weaken them is to weaken our enemy. I suppose that makes sense. Were these men to continue their work, our work would quickly be undone. How is that? We've caused them much grief. We strike at the arms, yes. But this is a Hydra that you face, and it is quick to replace that which is severed. Then we should lop off its head and be done with this. Soon, soon. We are close. Only one more man stands between us and our ultimate goal. I will return to my work. The sooner this last man dies, the sooner I might face our true enemy. Before you go, I have a question for you. Of course. What is the truth? We place faith in ourselves. We see the world the way it really is, and hope that one day all mankind might see the same. What is the world, then? An illusion. One which we can either submit to, as most do, or transcend. What is it to transcend? To recognize nothing is true and everything is permitted that laws arise not from divinity, but reason. I understand now that our creed does not command us to be free. It commands us to be wise. Do you see now why the Templars are a threat? Whereas we would dispel the illusion, they would use it to rule. Yes, to reshape the world in an image more pleasing to them. That is why I sent you to steal their treasure. That is why I keep it locked away. And that is why you kill them. So long as even one survives, so too does their desire to create a new world order. Take your equipment. Seek out this last man. With his death, Robert de Sable will at last be vulnerable. It will be done. Safety and peace upon you, Altair.
send you to an early death. He's going to hit someone. Entering a strong attack will leave your enemy vulnerable. Finish him by breaking his legs, or by throwing him to the ground. <laughs> 